What's happening? I think tonight, I think tonight I need a little garage hang. I'm gonna try to button up my car, get everything on the list done, and just kind of work through my new turning signals, my new headlights, and just kind of get the car done, because I need it the right now. That's what I need right now. So I'm just gonna get to work and just start hammering out some some triple OG work. You know what I'm saying, guys? So holla at your boy. We're gonna get into this same old, same old. Came from the bottom, pop a bottle, pour right at the drop. If you feeling the vibe, hit my line, I'm trying to stop it. If you down the ride, hide the sides, I'm on the option. Just look at the time, I'm about to get a rocket. I'm about to rock your world. I'll turn you to my girl. I want to take you out. I forgot how low this car was. Uh, tonight, just kind of like, every once in a while, I think like we all go through it where we just need a night to like just like wrench on our cars alone listen to whatever we got to listen to and just kind of like I don't know just find ourselves again that was kind of like my night tonight I was just listening to this is not a podcast podcast from Bobby Hunt one on it and uh it's much needed um, the car's ready to go I'm about to go take I think I'm gonna take it for a drive put headlights back in I didn't do my side mirrors yet but so I just want to hopefully go for a little cruise maybe. Everything everything works. It should be fine. It doesn't leak. So I'm just going to go cruise. Enjoy the night. Try to, try to just mob around. Maybe even wash it. But we'll see. I'm just going to pack up and get up all out of here. <laughs> What's going on guys? So I am kind of all over the place in the couple, past couple days. I've just been trying to get as much work done without trying to get backed up. But um, I'm in the process of uninstalling all the parts I installed on the S13. I think um, I'm definitely going to sell it. Just on the fact that I have like other goals in mind and other things I want to accomplish. So, And I just have to um, do everything in my power to get there. And that's part of that is getting rid of the, the old gal. So with that, I am going. I'm un in, or I'm uninstalling the headlights for the S13. I'm gonna take off the wheels. I don't know if I'm gonna do it all tonight. I'm just trying to get a little work done. And for now, that means taking out the headlights. Take these out. Put the stock ones back in, and then button her up. Perfect for a sale. Headlights are swapped and I am going to cut the grass now. But man, it's been a funky, a funky donkey weekend. I've just been all over the place trying to get uh, everything done. This, the Boo Bear is finally on the ground. Uh, I drove it like for a second. I probably will keep that. The food is already in there. But um, yeah, so I just have to clean up the garage. But I have so much stuff to do. I have to, des I have to design this one thing for my homie. <laughs> so much work, gotta cut the grass, so just a list of to do's, man. Just freaking shizzle, man. Alright, let me go cut the grass now. What up? What up? What up? What up? What up? Woo! Alright, guys, I was thinking I'm here just eating quick dinner, um, but I was thinking, like, this is advice for myself, right? This is advice for myself, basically that it's okay to 
take a step back. We're like, we're young enough to pretty much not take a step back, but build in silence rather than try to market with nothing to show. So basically, like I learned in the past couple months to not always put, like it's basically like putting an icing, putting icing on before you bake the cake. And I don't know why I'm sharing this with you as always, but um, that's where I feel like I'm at right now is where push, 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 and to get to the new, next level, it's gonna take a lot more kind of like silent in the dark work, like not necessarily always shown or always marketed or always, you know, I'm gonna try to bring you guys through the journey, but I really am working on like the next big move and sometimes the journey to get there is a lot of grind work, a lot of just hard work, selling stuff, saving, 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 not doing um, crazy stuff, not really inv like investing money rather than saving money. And that's where I'm at right now, because the next step is a, um, I'm gonna go after a store, I'm gonna get a store, that's gonna happen, without a doubt. I'm giving myself like 18 to 24 months to get it done, which is plenty of time, like two years basically. And, because a lot has changed, I mean everything, Every two years is like a lifetime. Not literally, but it always feels like every two years I always find myself in a different place. And um, so like, that's where I'm at right now, is where like, I'm gonna sell off everything I can like my blue car is always gonna, like S14 is always gonna stay there, but I'm going to pretty much get so, um, I just set, like basically set myself up to succeed, set myself up for success, and um, it's gonna be based around tattooing and clothing, and I have a whole process, or not a process, I have a whole idea on what I want it to be, and I have to get there with, with just like in the dark grinding, like just grind, work hard, don't give up and just like kind of like one of those put your head down and work and just hustle 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 don't like i can't afford like i can't uh i won't be able to do like crazy flashy things events big you know build my car because it's money in right now so that way i can set myself for the, for the future because we're looking at a building right now. and um yeah again i don't know why i'm telling you this i don't even know why i'm um but it's just that's where i feel i'm at so, I just had to get that out. I was like, I'm gonna film that at home. And I looked to my right, and my camera's right there. I'm like, huh, look at that. Grass is cut. I could go design something tonight. And, uh, yeah, after that, I'll be just working. Actually, I'll probably design them for the rest of the night. Cause, cause it's gonna be, um, it's intricate to design. Cause like, my buddy asked me to design something for his, like, drift team slash, bro I don't know, I think, yeah, drift team. And he has a decent design, but I feel like it's, like, my job to make it a little better and, like, bring it to real life. Because he wants to, like, digitize, but not, not like, embroidery digitize, but, yeah. I feel I'm work on tonight. I'm the old Wonkum. Get RC Parsi. Oh, I guess it's in this side too. I don't have, I don't have photos of the final products, but the tattoos from yesterday came out so good. Like, they're really happy with how clean it came out. Because lettering is always something that, it's not that I don't like it, I love it. It's just, from, I struggle with it so bad. I don't know why either. I would rather do like crazy scene or this, that, and the other thing, but just simple. Simple writing has always been something I've wanted to do and get better at. But woohoo! So I know this video is all over the place, guys. Welcome to my life. <laughs> Woo! Oh, you guys, gang, gang. I probably actually no. I'm gonna show you what I'm designing. So most likely, to that. That's good. Of course, I didn't, uh, since that day I didn't film, the whole week went by and I was like, I never edited that video. And, uh, yeah, I cut my hair. Yeah, I'm just, today, this, this week is something special. But, got some really cool stuff over this, over this week. Check out, uh, I have a new idea for, like, um, just, like, how to proceed with clothing. 
And um, so I started picking up like, I don't know, just like random t-shirts from a thrift store just to experiment on. Check out this shirt I got, it's pretty dope. I don't know if it's actually this old, but it's so sick. It's, it's um, oh man, it's so dope. It's like a old school run DMC slash DMC battle royale. I don't know if it's that old. The date says Friday, 1983. And June 29th is when me and Monica started dating. And we got married on that day. So I was like, that's so dope. And I picked up like that John, that John just for the heck of it because it's like super crazy. And then I got this little. Oh, this little Wayne one too. It's dope. And then also I got this flannel because I love this flannel. It's really sick. So I'm gonna embroider on it, do something with it. Uh, it's been a little bit of a <laughs> weird week, and I found like this hole of embroidery because I've been trying to figure out like how to embroider. Um, like I have the embroidery machine, we do it ourselves, but to digitize the files. That's when things get a little funky because it's not the easiest thing to learn how to digitize. I'm trying to learn it, and I've gotten close, um, but again, not not uh, not where I want to be. So again, this is my test sweatshirt. I pretty much just test uh, all my files on here, but uh, I did a. This one came out kind of cool. I just have to clean it up. It's a it's a K. It's kind of dope. And then just testing just different ideas. You can see like my satin stitch is way off. So I'm trying to figure out why that's happening. But yeah, just you know, doing things. Just, just trying to make it, man. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited. And then for the design that I was working on, that I said I was just referencing that I was working on, that came along. And I'm super happy with how it's coming out. And um, yeah, I just spent, I think, two nights on it because. He wanted to, uh, like, my homie wanted to adjust it and then he wanted to color. So I was like, I can do anything you want. You just gotta, uh, give me a couple more days. So, um, this is where we're at with Zazaza. So, nothing too crazy. Let's see if I have his drawing in here. That was his drawing, and usually I would just copy it over, but I just felt like this one had a lot of potential. So, bam. I feel like that came, came together cool. And uh, just just a real cool, cool idea. Working on a bunch of different things. I'm working on, what else am I working on? I got bananas. This is another design I wanna, I'm starting from scratch. It takes me a while when you're starting from scratch, but just a banana drift thing, because I love bananas. And like, I don't know if you guys ever seen that, the show Bananas in Pajamas, but that's my jam. And uh, yeah, dog. So, yeah, with that, I love you guys. It's Friday already, even though I'm probably gonna post this next week, because um, I don't know, I just like doing a early in the week post because the weekends get crazy. I am going to sell my S13 this weekend. To, going to my really good friend at, um, he's going to make like a street, uh, like a street car basically. He, he had a really cool S, he had a cool coupe that was a drift car. I wonder if I have footage of his car driving. Probably, I probably do, but it's somewhere. <laughs> what hurts. And then, uh, yeah, so probably gonna sell that. And like I said, just uh, just hustling, try, have, you know, goals in mind, just wanna get there and uh, gonna do everything in my power to get there. So um, I know this video was absolutely all over the place. Like editing, I was like, oh wow, good job, Ryan. <laughs> Got like two clips of everything you did. I am going to get this out, edited, get her done, and go to bed. Hopefully get it to bed a little early. So holla, anything new? Uh, I don't think so. I love you guys. Holla at your boys. Yeah. Happy Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Sunday. Ah, actually, we'll do a Sunday night upload. Happy Sunday, guys. I love you guys. Holla at your boys. Yeah. Bye, 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 bye.